What will the future of manufacturing be like? Imagine if everything you needed came exactly how you wanted. Super quick and in an eco-friendly way. Hi, I'm Sarah Lamptey and I'm here with Zoe Webster. So what can we expect? Well, things will be very different. You'll be closer to manufacturing. You'll see it in places you wouldn't currently expect to see it, from in hospitals, in smaller local businesses, and in the home, and it'll be a lot more personalised. So what kinds of things will this involve? Well, if you needed a new part for a household appliance, you could order it, get it made locally, and get it delivered to your door within a couple of hours. Or if there's a medicine you need, you could get that tailored to your genetic makeup and made at the GP or the chemist. Will this be better for the environment? It will. There'll be a lot less waste and less of a need to store large amounts of inventory in big warehouses. And also, advances in 3D printing and additive manufacturing will reduce waste even more and make it possible to make products and components that we can't make now. Do you think this is something that people are going to buy into? I think so. I think there'll be make miles, much like food miles. People will be much more empowered with data and information about where things are made and what they're made out of. Is this local approach going to mean the end of large factories? No, we will still need them to generate economies of scale. We'll need them, for example, to mass produce complex products that we'll need for large and growing international markets. OK, so how will those be different from what we already have? They'll be much more efficient. They'll be operating in a closed loop or circular economy system where the waste from one process can be the input to the next. Then I assume the Internet of Things will play a big part in this. It will. Everything will need to be connected to ensure that supply can keep track of changes in demand. So processes will be closely monitored to ensure we can minimise downtime or process hold-ups and materials will be tracked as they get recycled and reused from product to product. OK, so an obvious question perhaps. Will there still be a place for people in factories? There will be, but there'll be more autonomous robots working alongside people. So the robots can take care of the repetitive, the dangerous type stuff, and the people can focus on where human interaction is so valuable. So in design, engineering and innovation, and customer and supply relationship building. So lastly, how will all of this stuff change our lives? Well, you'll be able to get whatever you need or want in whatever form you want it, made locally or wherever it needs to be, and delivered to you much more quickly with much less impact on the environment. So whether you're a manufacturer or a consumer, we're going to see much more manufacturing as a part of our everyday lives. So what do you think?